Hello internet friends, your favorite cynical Capricorn, and today I'm taking you through my curly hair routine. What is this background? Well, audience, I'm on a rooftop because the lighting on this rooftop is for free. Now this curly hair routine is catered for those who have fine, thin, curly hair. There are countless videos on YouTube regarding curly hair routines and tutorials. And while they're all great in their own way, seldom do I come across routines that are for fine, thin hair. If that happens to be you, you might find this video very helpful because I myself have fine, thin hair. A word of discretion. At this time in my life, as a mid 20 year old, I am trying to save as much money as humanly possible. And that means for me, buying products that are affordable and accessible. And that means products from Walmart, Target, CVS, drugstores, grocery stores, department stores. Places that anybody can go and pick them up for a mostly minimal amount of money. Now I understand that there are incredible products on the market for curly hair now more than ever. But some of those products come at the cost of an extra $20, $30 over what I'm paying currently. I just want to put that out there because I know that the products I'm using are not the highest quality, but they work for me and they might work for you. They also work for my budget. If you like this sort of content, please consider liking the video and subscribing. I would greatly, greatly appreciate that. And now let's hop in to the routine. So here I am in my sassy bun, letting it down for you, bearing it all. As you can see, my hair is pretty matted on top and it's super dry on the ends. Now dry combing. I highly suggest this if your hair type allows for it. Not all curly hair types can do this, but if you can, do it. This will save you from losing hair and it'll save you products because you won't be using excess product to detangle your hair in the shower. So to do this, I'm literally using a brush from the 99 cent store. Do not judge me. I have not invested in a Denman brush, but one day I will get there. You're gonna start at the ends of your hair and you're going to slowly but surely work up inch by inch to get through the shaft and eventually to the root. Next, when you get in the shower, you'll wanna saturate the hair with water because this is vital to making your hair curl. Normally, I would go in with Tea Sal by Neutrogena as it promotes hair growth and it's good for sideroid dermatitis, an issue I currently deal with, but my hair is kind of dry, so I'm skipping straight to condition. This deep treatment mask by Shea Moisture rocks. The ingredients are awesome. There's no added fragrance and it's very affordable. I'll start by applying a chunk of it to the ends of my hair working up to the shaft and just putting a little bit on the top of my head as I do have some short bang pieces avoid applying conditioner to your roots if you want a voluminous look after letting this sit for the duration of my shower I rinse out this product with lukewarm water do not use cold water you do want to get the product out of your hair the only way to do that is to use warm ish water now here is the best kept curly hair secret dry your hair with a cotton t-shirt doesn't matter Matter what the t-shirt looks like all it needs to be is cotton do not rub your scalp or hair with the t-shirt simply get the excess moisture off of it now this step is optional but it is helpful lay your cotton t-shirt down on a flat surface and simply plop your wet hair on top of the t-shirt use the t-shirt and a flat hand to get the excess moisture out of your locks now this next step is vital to getting a gorgeous curl pattern and that is to scrunch your hair using a flat hand. Do not use your hand all crazy like this clip here. Flat hand, press the ends of the hair to the scalp. Repeat this all over your hair while it is wet. I also like to take my flat hand and the cotton t-shirt I use to dry my hair to press the ends of the hair toward the scalp. Let's talk products. I personally like to use a mousse because I feel that it gives me the definition I'm looking for that gel gives without making it crunchy or weighing it down. I like this mousse right here from Tresemme. It's fine, not remarkable, but it does the job. These are products I've tried in the past. I think the Frizzies gel works great, though most gels work for curly hair. Just don't apply too much, it'll make your hair crunchy. And the Cantu Curl Cream, I would skip on. It made my hair super greasy. When it comes to applying products, make sure you apply them sparingly. I'm using a palm-sized amount and starting by applying it to the ends and working my way to the root. This product is going to add definition and reduce frizz. The second best
best kept secret to curly hair is reforming your curls. You wanna grab a single curl, twirl it in the direction that it curls, use that flat hand and press it back toward the scalp. You're gonna wanna do this all over your head. While it may be sort of time consuming, the end result is so worth it. Remember, spin the curl and press toward the scalp. After applying product and reforming your curls, the next thing you want to do is to just leave your hair alone. Let it dry. If you stop touching it, you will actually minimize frizz the most. If you have a diffuser, feel free to use it. That is an option. I myself just like to let my air hair dry by flipping it side to side. And this is my finished product. Curls that are defined yet still look soft and kind of beachy. I would love to get a haircut right now, but uh, Miss Rona decided to take over the world, so I feel like we're all in the same boat. My results are defined curls with minimal frizz. All right, everybody, that's all I've got for you today. I wanna say thank you so freaking much for watching all the way through. If you could please like and subscribe, and additionally, leave your own curly hair tips in the comments down below. I'm open to trying anything. Until next time, remember, tomorrow does not exist. Goodbye. Special thanks to The Curl Ninja and Dr. Dre here on YouTube. They have been vital to helping me create my own curly hair routine.